Creepy, how are you doing? How are things? Wasn't very oh, here we go. What the f really? What are those? Doctor's note patient Magdalena von Schmidt. In order to treat your wife's pronounced hysteria, melancholia, you must be spared in any kind of emotional strain. She must avoid any objects or persons that might trigger an episode. I recommend one injection every two days until her symptoms start to improve. Daily injections are recommended during more severe melancholic phases. Dr. Drish. June 11th, 1908. Oh, that sucks. <gasps> okay. One more. Oh. Oh. Yellow. It's so the yellow whale, right? Bomb on the top one. Bomb in the middle one. Just empty on the bottom. <sighs> that literally scared me. I f Thank you, Twy. I don't know where I'm supposed to necessarily go with that information, but here we are. Fuck off. Are you crazy? No idea, but it sounded important. Yeah. <laughs> One token for a vending machine. Above there are strange religious symbols. Ah, oh, I see. Oh, it's a lock. Oh, it's like our locker. Oh, so you can. That'll work anywhere. Okay. I get it. I get it. Can't break that yet. And we got more chips. Fucking Jesus Christ. What the fuck was that? Why would you do that? Oh my God. Fuck. Son of a bitch. You too now? I did not play that yet, Twy. I do have it though. Um, I think you're the one that told me about it. I was on Key Miller, I believe. I need to get it. I need to actually play it though. Triple X every day. My word. Why does it sound like someone is fucking... I believe I can... It was like that before, I think. Oh god, I don't know. I'm close to that too, and I don't know how I feel about it. <laughs> Alright, stay up. Stay up. Oh, for fuck's sakes. That's what she... One token for a vending machine above there are strange religious symbols. Ah, oh, I see. Oh, it's a lock. Oh, it's like our locker. Oh, so you can. That'll work anywhere. Okay. I get it. I get it. Can't break that yet. And we got more chips. Fucking Jesus Christ. What the fuck was that? Why would you do that? Oh, my God. That's really That's fucking scary. Yeah. Good thing nothing happened to that. Jesus. 
<sighs> what are we looking back in here for? What was that all about? He was it looked like he like turned around when he was like he was looking at something. <sighs> Small thing I don't really fucking need. That's cell 09. Ooh. Cell 10. Cell 8. First floor. Oh, yeah, right, right, right. I recall this now. Do we not? Of course, the fact I would give you the dining room key. Yeah. Oh, fuck! Okay. Oh, fuck! Come on! Oh, I haven't dealt with that this entire fucking game. Like, the entire time I've been going back and forth between that spot, and, and then you go and fucking do that to me. Scarecrow, I'm the laughing wind of God. Well, that's not good. Nice little Danish. Bedroom's locked, then what's this? It seems like the reflected image in these mirrors can change. It's better not to touch anything for now. Okay, so that's a new... Um... Like, <laughs> fucking shit, cock! Oh, come on! Related to it, in a 1994 study, 45% of those with a foot fetish were found to be aroused by smelly socks or feet, making Gross. it one of the most widespread forms of olfactophilia. Why? Why do I need to What the fuck? What in the fuck, dude? Alright, so stamping random bodies out maybe is not the best idea now. Would have been cool if I got something for that. Oh, I have to push it? Okay. Yeah, push it. Push it real good. Okay, enough of that. Sorry. It was like that before, I think. Oh, God, I don't know. I'm close to that, too, and I don't know how I feel about it. <laughs> Alright, stay up. Stay up. Oh, for fuck's sakes. That's what she thought. Creepy, how are you doing? How are things? Wasn't very... Oh. oh. What the f Really? What are those? Oh, thank you. I'm like, why? What the fuck's going on there? The light changed color. Don't know. Oh, she's gone. Ah! Oh, fuck! Come on. The woman in the alley, you found a hidden jump. There. Do you need candles? <laughs> and Elisa Lombardi. Also here. The, hold on. So the candles are for who exactly? Candles of the Deceased. Okay, so the ones that are on the list. Okay, so... Martina Rossi... On the list. <laughs> Fuck you. Sophia, proper box, key, bedroom, closet. Hey, welcome in, everybody. Happy Saturday. We are... Uh... 
14th of October, so we're we're just about at the central central. We're at the middle point of Jugtober already. It's been flying by this year. Um and uh we are already up to five hundred and thirty one dollars. That is fucking outstanding. Uh baffles me, seriously, how much money um we raise every fucking year. And uh it's it gets cooler every year to see how it like evolves more and more and how you know we see the the usuals that come back and uh there's people that are are definitely here more often because of jugtober and then we have new people that find us and learn about jugtober and maybe they come back the year after you never know um yeah yesterday was fucking insane uh, was not anticipating pulling out a nine and a half hour stream yesterday. So if you were able to make it yesterday at the random Friday stream, um, you knew it was a good one. Uh, we started off with some clone hero. I just played solo and, uh, played a bunch of new charts that I found and, and grabbed offline. And, uh, then I switched over to the telephone. Uh, that was the new title that came out yesterday, actually from Daniel Matters Games. And, uh, yeah, we had a great fucking time with that game. I ended up playing the whole thing, beating it in one sitting. And, uh, yeah, it was a fucking blast. Uh, very similar to Lost Alone, um, or Lost Alone Ultimate, if you want to call it that. Um, and, uh, definitely had some, some vibes from, uh, the other game he made um uh who knocks so i i enjoyed it um we never got to finish who knocks because there was a big bug that we hit at the end of the game we couldn't progress so i may end up restarting that at some point down the line uh so if you were a fan of lost alone ultimate um or even if you were here yesterday for the telephone you liked either or of those games make sure or, you stretch oh. out those cream hands Brian what would i do without you telling me to fucking stretch every goddamn day thank you sir thank you very much oh. Oh. and how are you this evening i saw your uh your review of a demo it wasn't uh it wasn't very good <laughs> as far as i could tell <laughs> Um, but, uh, yeah, meanwhile, tonight we're getting back into Ad Infinitum. Um, I don't know how far we are into this game. I can't really tell. I feel like we're getting close to the end, but at the same time, like, I have no idea. So <laughs> it's real going to be interesting. I know if you didn't stretch, I was going to stretch you out. Oh my word. <laughs> God, you take me to dinner first. Holy shit. To Brian and everyone else, cheers. Happy Saturday. Uh, now, um, that demo was dog shit. <laughs> yeah. Um, I don't remember what it was, but I remember, like, I read what you had to say about it, and I was like, oof, yikes. <laughs> You also did the Devourer. Devourer. Is that actually like a Devourer ripoff? That'd be pretty funny. No, it wasn't okay. Ah. <laughs> uh. <sighs> you think Diana posted it? Okay. I have to. If it's the one that Jam mentioned. No, that's not the one that Jam mentioned. He mentioned a different one. No. Oh. Uh. Shit. I have, like, no water. <laughs> I'm going to throw it on top of that. 6 out of 10? That's pretty solid. And for a demo, I can't, it's not bad either. I think it's a pretty respectable mark. I mean, I... There's only a few demos I've ever played and been like, wow. Uh, yeah, I say most of them. Most demos I've played are either like a four to a six, maybe. 
Looks like it has a lot of room to work. That's good. That's good. Yeah, if they have a good foundation and a good concept, and they can execute a demo pretty well, just to get like the conversation up, yeah, obviously, then it's they're gonna they'll make dividends on it. Woo. Oh god, why am I yawning already? It's only ten thirty. Fuck. All right. Well, regardless, um. I'm going to get right into the game tonight, I think. Um, even though we're kind of building up on the spins again, I think I'm going to chill for a bit on it. Um, maybe I'll do a couple spins to start Monday. Just tagged you on the game. Awesome. Appreciate it. The Devourer, Hunted Souls. Actually, I'll bring up Steam right now so I don't fucking forget to handle my shit right now. I already have it on the wish list. Oh, nice. Okay. Boo, boo, boo. VR supported demo? Oh, God. Oh, it comes out in like two weeks. Nice. Very nifty. Okay. I will look into that. Thank you very much, sir. If it got a 6 out of 10 for the demo, then it should be nice. Yeah. Exactly. It has the promise. So yeah, Ad Infinitum, this World War I horror game, pretty decent. Um, definitely has some, um, maybe because I just played it, like, within the last couple of months, was um, uh, Amnesia, the bunker. I do know a Bridge Curse 2 demo, though. 10? Ooh, wow. Yeah, I've heard a couple people say the demo is fantastic. Um, I really liked the first game, too, so give me free stuff. Free demo, man. Get all them free demos. So, uh, Wheeler, now that you're here, Wheeler's like, uh, he, he's like the part-time horror friend. He'll, he'll play the shit, but not typically. But, uh, yeah, Wheeler, Brian and I were just discussing some demos, and, um, the Bridge Curse 2 is coming out soon, and they dropped a really good demo, and people have been raving about it. Um, if you haven't had a chance, play the first one. It was actually quite good. Pretty scary. Um, I think I got a couple streams out of it, though, so I don't know. If, I mean, with your length streams, maybe two streams for you. Without the random bugs, it's a 10. Ah, okay. I got better to do, like, uh, not shit my pants. But you gotta start practicing. You're gonna start shitting your pants all the time. Breakfast also enjoyed it. Yeah, you know something's good if breakfast enjoys it. <laughs> you know? He he's very good at finding the small things that he doesn't like about games. And I'm not and that's not a rag or anything. Um but when he says something's really good, like that's a pretty good seal of approval. I don't think anything he's recommended to me has sucked. <laughs> so uh but yeah. Speaking about games, this game reminds me, it had a lot of feeling of um, Amnesia the Bunker when we're actually in, like, the war setting. Um, before, it, like, we zoom back to that random, like, apartment building. Um, it's been an interesting story so far, too. And, and I like this concept of this game, and it's been working pretty well, I'd have to say. Without further ado, let's... Uh... I can play it. I will not recommend games I don't feel strong about. That's fair. Yeah. I feel it. Oh. Okay. Oh. 
I was like, what the fuck noise is this? Oh, of course, it's Fry. Hi, Fry. Think you'll finish it tonight? Um, I don't know. I don't really know how long this game is. I didn't, I didn't look yet. But, I don't know. It's a good possibility. I mean, if I'm not falling asleep by 2 o'clock, I'll keep going until I can get it done. <laughs> Within reason. Where the fuck am I going? Oh, I forgot I had this fucking goofy-ass light now. Oh shit, it's more of that gas. Oh no, does that mean there's something scary here? What, what is even my objective right now? <laughs> I don't even know what I'm doing. Find the exit of the hospital. Oh, lovely. All I got is a pickaxe, gas mask, the dynamo flashlight, and wire cutters. Oh, the wire cutters are big though. Nothing in my backpack. I got one document regarding the patient numbers and whatnot. Like, do I go this way? Cynthia, what's up? Welcome in, my friend. Hope you're doing well. Oh. Oh, yes, we were learning how to cut all this shit. Hello? I remember having problems with one of these, like, wires somewhere. It wouldn't cut. Oh, sh- Excuse you! All right, so I don't think I can touch that one yet. Can I touch this one? Oh, so I have to cut them in order first. Okay. You can't cut the moving ones. Doing okay? I haven't been feeling well the past three days. Oh, that sucks. Well, I hope you start feeling better soon. And if possible, hopefully, Stream tonight will get you in a little bit of a mood to feel a bit better. You never know. Either way, I appreciate you spending time here, especially if you're not feeling well. Um, I'm doing pretty good. I had a really, really lazy fucking day today. I didn't do much of anything. I was zonked after yesterday. Um, but then my mom came by. We had dinner. Um, and I played some Clone Hero with Nox for a little while. And now I'm here. It's always fun being here. Thank you, I appreciate that. It It's for me too. It's always fun for me being here. Uh, so it's a two-way street. Hello? Yo, what's up? Despicable traitors. Ran all over town for errands and finishing my Halloween costume. Nice. My Halloween costume's in a box behind me, which we're... I think it's the $900. I know that... So 600 Steam Game Giveaway. 700 is a merch giveaway, one of each of the 12 new items. 800 is another Steam Game Giveaway. And then I think 900 is the as my costume stream. Turn the power back on. Bro, why is the power off? What are we talking about here? Power's out. You wonder if you should follow these cables. Bro, the power's on. What are we what are we saying? Okay. So we're just getting a couple things for my costume. Nice. Cynthia, what are you gonna be? For Halloween, which what's your costume idea? No entry. Oh boy. Well, this is where I came from, so. Doo -doo. Yeah, this is like a more linear amnesia re- uh, not rebirth. <sighs> amnesia bunker. This way? 
Born as a pirate? Nice. My hair's gonna be blue. That's fucking awesome. Love it. Oh, son of a bitch. I do have to go out in the gas. Okay. I don't like the gas. All right, well done, well done. Can I, how do I, 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 I can't, hello? Why is this not working? Can't do anything with it. Wait. What is this over here? Looks like another cable. But I can't go to the left here. What the fuck? No. Is it actually not in there? Oh, it's just that light. There's probably another light. Too. Oh yeah, that light. Okay, never mind. That's just like outwards. I like while playing more AC Mirage. Nice, enjoy it. Thank you for the lurk, Wheeler. All right, so what's going on here? Why can I not? Turn the power back on. I mean, it sounds like it's on, but I can't read that. And you'd think it'd be a green light, right? If it was on? I don't know. Maybe I'll try the following the other cable. Because there was two that came out of there, I believe. Ooh. Make sure there's nothing there that was sketch ball. It's really weird. I can't get in there anyways. Something over there and I can't... There's no door over here. If there is, it's covered. Went back this way. Yeah, you keep telling me I have to use my cutters. I know I have them and what they're used for. This looks like the blue spray that I have, so I might dye my hair blue. Oh! I like it. I colored my hair once. It was the summer between sixth and seventh grade. And I had just seen the jackal for the first time. And I you thought Bruce save was- some of that meat for me, you know what I'm saying? <laughs> blah, blah, blah. Okay, I'll save it. And that was uh, Bruce Willis and he had like bleach blonde hair in that game. And I was a movie that was like, fuck yeah. Thanks, Oodaloo. Alright, so there's only one cable coming out of here. Oh, this one. How are we, Mr. Oodaloo? How are things? Howdy, Padna! <laughs> oh, it's just the cable for the fucking light. So I was going the right way. I went to the right spot. I just can't do anything with the switch for some reason. Oh yeah, and this is all the, uh... Yeah, I have to... F the, I can get these via, um, something to do with the, the numbers. Assign the patient's lockers according to their patient numbers. Yeah. Patient files must be kept under lock. Key to, yeah, that's how we found the one we had to get to. Been all day drinking hard stairs and eating all sorts of food. Nice. There's, do I need to send you the audio clip of Power talking about Dick? Oh, I've I've seen it. That one was special because he he specifically asked me to save him meat, so I had to use it. But yes, I fucking love that audio. 
My belly is full, my brain is fuzzy. How's your evening of Jugtober? Going good, we just started recently. Um, problem is where we are in this game right now. I need to like, okay, that's just a light as well. I have to fucking turn the power back on because some for some reason it's off or they think it's off and I'm like, well, this seems to be on. And that just goes to a spot that it looks like it's on. It's just a red light, but it looks like it's on. And there's no other cable coming out of here. Oh, it's this door. Ugh. Dear hello. Note from Junior D Dr. Lau. Oh, it's a different one. Oh, dear Emma, today Dr. Eisenbarth tried to force me to cut off a soldier's healthy legs. I refused. Eisenbarth did the deed himself, clearing me the whole time. He didn't even sterilize the surgical instruments. He has ordered me to report to his office later. The head nurse says we can talk it over and settle the matter. I hope she is right. Yikes. Head nurse's report. Dear Dr. Eisenbarth, I've taken care of the matter with nurse Emma. Page 27 gave me a hand. Junior Dr. Lau woke up yesterday. He's a strong young man. He has already asked for more proth uh, prostheses. Pro prostheses? More prosthetic parts. I'll just let myself in. No big deal. Wait, haven't I been here? have been here. I think all of these fucking files are missing except for a couple people. It doesn't like, you can't figure out any like actual things from this. I just can't remember. Who was I looking for when I found it? And I was like, oh, okay. The head nurse or the head nurse. <laughs> Got him. That's fucking funny. <laughs> I don't remember what we had this for. Oh, is it this? Yeah, I'm keeping the key to the maintenance room in my locker. Number 82, the combination is my two best comrades. Which, we are, yeah, we already got to the two fucking assholes. The other two traitors. And I can't go back from here, because obviously I got locked in, locked out of that spot. So I have been in here before. Thought so. And it's not like I can open anything else. Any more pieces of that locker. Alright, so... Let's pretend the power is still on. What's over here? Power's out. You wonder if you should follow these cables. Do you want me to follow these ones instead? Alright, this I could probably do. In my DM. Thank you. Appreciate you, Brian. Whoa! Eight second audio clip. All right. All right. The problem is, I don't think you're going to be able to hear it if I just play it on here. Actually, I think it should pick up in Discord. Let's see. Do these taste like dick? I don't know. <laughs> I don't smell like dick. This would dick take, this is what dick tastes like. Oh, fuck it. <laughs> what the fuck? <laughs> 
Oh my word. Thank you for that, Brian. <laughs> Oh, I liked that song. It broke to did. I gotta follow the cable. What's this? Patience note one. Gefreiter Mikowski is gone. I spoke with him before I went to sleep. He was as scared as I am. He was laying on the bed next to me. Now he is gone. The nurse refused to answer my questions. They don't even look me in the eye. HW. It was really longer because he paused at some point. I had to trim it. Well done. <laughs> hey. Fuck me, man. What is that? Well, the good news is I can't go down there until the power is back on. I, I'm trying to... The power is out. I wonder if you should follow these cables. Okay. What's that? Look at the egg makes the bile rise in your stomach. That's when Power was eating candy. Ah. Aha. Dun 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 dun. Dung 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 dung. This way. This, oop. This way. It's in back behind there. Warfstadt. What the fuck? Oh. Out of context at its best. Hell yeah. All these fucking doors are locked because of power. I don't mean. Codename power. Eisenbarth, malleable. The development of our prosthesis has progressed so far that I've now succeeded in convincing Supreme Army Command of my plans. Now all employees of the sanatorium shall regard what remains of the patient's bodies as clay to be formed. Imperfect tools whose quality and functionality must be improved by our prosthesis so they may achieve the goals of the Supreme Army Command of the Kaiser. Signed, Dr. Eisenbarth. Fucking God. Go over this way. I want more of that fucking polka music, please. I felt a lot happier when it was on. All the way across. I was across then. Oh. It's making sure. Okay. Jesus, Mary, and Joseph. There's the music. literally at this dude's fucking house right now. What the fuck? Eisenbarth, pain. Head nurse, amputations must always be performed without anesthesia. Should one of your nurses or a junior doctor contradict this order again, this is to be reported to me immediately. Every ounce of pain caused by the incisions of the scalpel and the saw is equivalent to the purifying fire of war from which our patients have fled through death and injury. These are the birth pains of the frontline soldier. Signed, Dr. Eisenbarth. What the fuck, bro? I 
Eisenbach security doors to ensure the safety of our medical staff as of today. Our doors will be secured using electrical system. The fuse boxes in the maintenance room control access to the main hall for administration and shower areas. You daisy chained a bunch of fucking doors shut on me? Motherfucker. Red, that's usually a bad sa What the fuck is that? Oh no! I can't use my flashlight! Bro, I'm stuck! I backed up into a spot. No fucking way I did that. <laughs> I backed into it, and this thing probably didn't exist, and neither did that. I can't even get the fucking phone. Oh, I can. Never mind. Off to bed. Take it easy, Brian. Appreciate you, dude. Fuck, how do I get over this? I think I have to fucking reload. Reload last checkpoint. Fuck. Just unback up. I tried. Ding dong dong. That's awfully fucking annoying though. I was trying to get the fuck out of the way of that thing coming through. <sighs> Oh, it's saved right in here. That fucking rules. Ding dong dong. So anywhere there's a fucking bloody cot, apparently it's a save point. I fucking don't like this. Where am I to fucking go? Oh, I have to, oh that's right. I have to back. I have to follow the fucking the cables all the way back. Can't just bring this lamp with me for fuck's sakes. that go just go just go fuck fuck I have to cut things oh no oh shit I can't even walk that way I can't walk around it Oh, fuck that. Go, go, go! Oh, God damn it. How's my health looking? I don't think I even... I, don't, I, th I think they heal that... It's like a self-healing thing. Now that I think of it. Alright. Let me not act hastily here. Let me look around for... Any pickups or stuff anywhere. I don't think there is anything. But I just wanted to make sure... Can't get mad at me for looking. I mean, you could. Oh, that 
That's not good. Thank God that light was on, though. God, that is fucked. The fuck do I get around? Oh. You just chill out there, okay, pal? I'm thinking they're not very fast. Cut! Cut! You fucking asshole! Cut the goddamn barbed wire! Fuck, where's the cable? I cut through nothingness. For no reason. Fuck, and now he's exactly where I need to be. Happen. There's no way. There's so many of them. Fuck. Oh shit! No! Freeze, bitch! Oh, fuck, I can't. I forgot. That sucks. I forgot you- I can't sneak past them. I have to I get actual distance around them. That sucks. Is that the first time I've died? I don't think I've ever seen a loading screen like this before. I mean, I've seen the Ouroboros thing, but... Alright, so we're- alright, we're back here. Haha, <laughs> he's still stuck. Alright, what the fuck? <laughs> Come on. Bastard. Welcome in, Father. Hope you're doing splendid. Wait, so am I following yellow? I think I follow yellow. Fuck, I don't know. I think yellow is what... Yeah, yellow brings the power. I think I was going the wrong way the whole time. I think I have to go red. Yeah, I have to follow these cables. You follow, I have to follow red. Okay. Sir, 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 madam, whatever your fucking name is. Oh, shit. Fuck, I'm dead. Ah, fuck, 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 I'm stuck, I'm stuck. Where's the fucking cable? There it is. Come on, man, I hate that. That's so stupid. Like, let me go past them.
Oh no. I did go backwards. Fuck. I went the wrong fucking way. I did have to follow yellow. In fact, it's easy if I just do this. Hold it easy if I just die. Alright, so red to yellow, and then probably another red from there, I guess. Lovely, yeah. <laughs> Basically. Oh. Uh, we're gonna get out of here. We're gonna all this power is gonna get turned on. We're gonna get the fuck out. But a bum bum bum. -bum. All right, follow yellow. Which is what I think I was doing initially. Down the outskirts. Can't get me, bitch. Yellow. Oh, here it is. Where'd the egg go? Wasn't there a giant egg here before? Oh, fuck. They're stuck in here. I want to go home. Yikes. Rebirth. In light of patient 26 bloodline, I have selected him for an entirely new treatment, the Ovum Victorious. Plaster of the powdered bone, hair, and fingernails of selected uh, soldiers will form the shell. The maturation fluid inside will be a mixed solution of marrow and bodily fluids. Wound fluid in particular is crucial to the success of the treatment. In the ovum, the body will be ripened over the course of several weeks by means of electrical stimulation. I expect great results. Signed, Dr. Eisenbarth. Yeah, okay. So, problem. Something is hatched. The shell sinks to blood and excrement. I'd say we're fucked. Jesus. I don't like this. I know one's hiding in this corner, then that's good. What? Not in that corner either. Alright. Time to get the shit scared out of me now. Here we go. Or not? Wait, why is this quiet? Oh, fuck, he got out! Jesus fucking... Oh. <laughs> oh my god. Oh, is a huge fucking fire broke out. There. That'll light the way. Fuck. At least that thing's dead. Oh, God. Bring it all down! Follow the red line, I guess. It's bright enough where they can't move. Ah, 
I'm not gonna walk on top of it. Oh god! Oh no! Oh come on, dude! I fucking hate that. It's so dumb. Fuck! Fuck! Go! 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 Survived the first encounter with the mayhem. Oh, great. Back in the trenches. No big deal. Everything's awesome. But hey, we got out of the hospital, so that's good. Oh, I wonder if we're gonna run it. Oh, we won't see that big fucking fast thing anymore because I blew it up last time. I almost forgot about that. All right. Now, what do we do? Find the way back to the command bunker. Sounds good. Never mind. Pick up the phone first. Can you hear me, yep. What? You hear the screams? Yup. The enemy has broken into our trenches once more. Oh, fuck. Meet me in the command bunker. It's up to us now. There's no one else left. Are you done? Okay. Okay, not that way. We'll take the lit path. Sick bay. Wouldn't the sick bay be the hospital, though? What's this? Dr. Eisenbrough Sanatorium, you can't help but laugh when you see the painted words. Oh, God. Box report. Dear Sergeant General, I'm ready to lodge an official complaint regarding the new uh, company Fuhrer, Lieutenant von Schmidt. Despite my pr protestations, he insists upon referring to me as Dr. Eisenbarth after that deplorable drinking song. He has even had Unteroffizier Egert and Unteroffizier from, from paint the name on a sign in front of my office. I'm under dying by the dozen. Their lungs ravaged by poison gas. Typhoid is also widespread. And on top of all this, I now have to deal with a buffoon of a lieutenant telling his men I can magically restore the dead to life. In light of the lieutenant's lack of experience, I have attempted to remain tolerant of his shenanigans. However, even I have my limits. With respect, Dr. Wiedenbacher, number 8th, 1917. Newman's death. Confidential death of Gefried to Newman. Dear Dr. Wiedenbach, I had the misfortune of watching while Unteroffizier Egert and Fromm pushed Gefrieter Newman out into no man's land wearing nothing but his boots. He was shot. After I managed to pull his body back into the trench, the two Unteroffizier started hag haggling over his boots and possessions. Would it be wise to report this to the lieutenant? Respectfully, Feldwebel Hilke. Wow, that's fucked. Well, found another dog tag. The dummy has nothing but content for you. <laughs> Alright, that's locked. Oh, another one. That's ending. Ezek. Excuse me. My word. Another one? Wow. A new. So weak we can hardly stand. If German pride will not permit us to surrender, then we shall die. I suppose we may as well go to hell. At least we won't drag the rest of the world down with us. Eck. Poem, part one. 
Lone in the woods, red flower blooms. Soon, all too soon, I shall meet my doom. Soon, all too soon. A lump of lead somewhere will take my sorrow. Be it today or be it tomorrow. Rest is missing. Afner. Uh, so this all goes around in a big circle. I guess this way? Oh, yeah. Obviously, I haven't been this way yet. Oh. This way is latrines, sick bay, path of the lion. Oh, it's the generator. Steel monstrosity has a hose connected to it. Where's the hose go? Oh, a poor bird. I'll save you, bud. Here you go. Oh. At least you didn't have to suffer anymore. It was underground right there. Oh. There's a lot of fucking barbed wire here. I can't use my light. Something's up here. Oh, shit! What is that? Fuck. Ah. Another one down. Another one down. And eh. another one somewhere. Ah. There we go. Okay, so that thing was in a bunch of dead birds and just came crawling out and went in there, which I am not going to go that way. All set with that. Oh, I can't go this way either. Path of the Lion, Hamburg Avenue. All right, we'll go this way. Just towards Path of the Lion. Okay, everything's Path of the Lion. special over here nope always looking for those dog tags because I think there's 17 out of 28 dog tags and 2 out of 28 French identification bracelets okay oh lovely mind the hole That's the dark path? Well, <laughs> darn, it's uh, blocked off. I can't go. The crank's jammed. The pulley won't budge. The tunnel is flooded. You can't get through. There must be a water pump around here somewhere. The thing I was just at? God damn it all. And I know what the pump does. Uh-oh. This goes to this machine here. Of 
question is, why didn't that turn on? Ah. It needs fuel. That's... Yeah, okay. That makes sense. I guess we'll look this way. Can I siphon it? Oh, this looks like there's gas here. Staying exempt, you can't get anything out of it. Oh, well, that's a fucking bummer. Every way I can fucking siphon the gas out of here, right? Stamp bill delivery. Current inv inventory. 14 barrels. Capacity, 216 liters each. Delivered today. 3 barrels. Capacity, 216 liters each. Empty fuel canister. Alright, well, that's a start. We had to find out. We had to find something to put the gas in. Right? So... Nothing to read or see in here, apparently. Okay, can I open this? No. All oh, right. It's this way. Not happening. All right, they're making this real easy now. Ah, okay. It must be empty as well, yeah. That must be it. Nice, full diesel oil canister. Let's go. I right, should go back and fill that thing up. Shouldn't be too, too bad. Okay. Is all that blood there before? Probably, I just don't remember. Boom. Boom. Suck that water out. Awesome. I'm just gonna follow the big pipe back to that spot. And go on down. I zoomed all the way down real quick. That was good. Oh, but this isn't. What the fuck happened in here? Oh no, these assholes again. Oh, are they above me? Something to pick up here. Oh, on a dog tag. Fifty. Oh, he's stuck in the light. down 
You're gonna get stuck over here. Come on. Dumbass. Turned around. That's what I fucking thought. There's a shortcut over here? No. I can't crawl up the, uh... The, uh, bunk bed, apparently. See ya, dumbass. Uh -huh. Well, you're stuck there. Fuck. We not. Fuck, which way do I go? Oh, right here. No, I can't go that way. This way. Woo! Go, go, go! And now we got gas to deal with? Oh my god. A little too close. Another one. Food theft. Kazik, you work, and I fit up of those bare bones rations. The Lieutenant's pets get anything they want. We're gonna sneak in and grab what we're what we've earned. Schnapps, brandy, tobacco. We'll stash our loot in the old shaft. No one dares go down there. We're not scared of anything anymore. Not the Lieutenant and not the shaft. It'll all be over soon anyways. LL. Well, Hate to tell you. Hubert. What's up, dude? How you doing? Ooh. Another dog tag from Kaplan. Good in you? I'm doing good, man. You know, living the dream, as some people would say. All right. I don't think I need the gas mask anymore. Ah, this is locked. East. East? I thought you said weast. <laughs> Daddy chill. My, my. What's that way to the bunks? What's in here? A save spot. Oop. No music to play? Come on, man. Oh my god, did I make it back? I did, I'm back in the bunker. Holy shit, I made it. Oh, I think I already read that before. Maybe not. 19 out of 28. Yeah, we're getting close on those. A few years ago, the Wolf gave the order to severely reduce our rations. Instead of our daily loaf of bread, now all we get is rusks and canned meat. We got potatoes, no turnips, no other vegetables. Soon we'll be all be forced to live off the donations from the civilians back home. Yikes. Recipe for flour soup. Serves eight. 80 grams of lard, 120 grams of flour, two stock cubes, pinch of caraway, pinch of nutmeg, salt and pepper to taste. Directions, fill a large saucepan with water, bring to the boil, register on the ingredients, season to taste. Wow. 
flour soup. Oh, the sign. Ah, Schmidtens, Schmidtens. Yes. Jawohl. Why are you back in there? Yo, Daddy O, let me in. Ah, there you are, soldier. I knew I could count on you. Even though you failed to stop that fiendish saboteur. Oh, wow. But we don't need weapons to get the job done, do we? At ease, soldier. Your reliability and ambition <clears throat> are exemplary. Exemplary. I managed to get through to Supreme Army Command. However, I'm afraid I have some bad news. Oh, okay, we Wayne Barrett. Out here. Deserters and traitors back home are trying to drive a dagger into our backs. They want to force the Kaiser and the Supreme Army Command to surrender. How dare they? Cowards. They have no idea what things are like out here on the front. We are being overrun. Perhaps they are even responsible for these freaks of nature that plague our trenches. They want to hold us back. Hmm. The fuck? This new enemy, it even has aerial capability now, attacking from the sky. It's that bird thing. It hates the light. I managed to blind it with our searchlights. But then its scream short-circuited everything. The fuses, the wires, all burnt out. Hello? This enemy knows no mercy. Oh, okay. It will not stop at our borders. If we lay down arms, it will ravage the whole fatherland. The Weltenbrand will be upon us and the world will burn. Everything we fought for will be lost. The Kaiser and Supreme Army Command are aware of our efforts. They're counting on us. There's some technical equipment in my plane. Fuses, among other things. Out there in no man's land. Soldier, attention! You will fight your way through to the crash plane in the west. Secure the equipment. The fuse for the searchlight. Then we can blind this monstrosity. Sure. No, nothing bad's gonna happen I'll now. I'll cover you from up there. I see things so much clearer now. Oh, okay. I'll keep an eye on you. And then, then, we will be the cleansing fire. We will wipe the enemy off the face of the earth and earn our way back home. No faltering, no hesitation, for freedom and the fatherland dismissed. Soldier. Got it, dude. Order standby. Radio operator on duty. Unteroffizier Johannes von Schmidt. Hey, that's me. Date September 10th, 1917. Attention. Strictly confidential orders for the duty officer. Pressure on our troops and our homeland is growing. We must absorb this pressure and return it tenfold. The slightest hesitation could cost us our victory. Stand by for further orders, Supreme Army Command. You're not letting me go around at all over there? I want to read the map. I want to read the map. Can't read the map. Oh. Ooh. Found the key to the path of the hero. Thank you. I sure feel like a hero. Your table, you're back. Anything else over here? Importance. I can't go up there after you? Okay, that makes sense. Ordered searchlight. Radio operator on duty. Unteroffizier Johannes von Schmidt. Attention. Strictly confidential orders to the duty officer. Effective immediately. All anti aircraft searchlights are now connected to an electrical system. This is highly sensitive military equipment. Reliable power supply must be established for the use of this system. 
It's a matter of the utmost urgency. All sections of the field through which the power supply runs must be protected against access and sabotage by the enemy. Yeah, how'd that go? Your direct line of Supreme Army Command. Your telegraph. There are 27 men waiting on your orders. Found the hairspray. Oh, nice. Sounds like it's coming along nicely. Right, this is Path to Hero over here. Unlock it and open it and we go. Out to no man's land to go get fucking supplies from a crashed aircraft. Oh boy. We back. This does not look good. Oh yeah, no, it does not look good. Holy shit. Boy. Thank you, Cynthia. Caution, enemy fire. That may be the right way, so let me check the other way first. Ooh, crazy world, huh? Crazy well, world, Well, don't let it huh? get you down, son. I... Penis, 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 penis. <laughs> What's up, tree? How you doing, man? Welcome in, my dude. So this was the right way to go. As I thought. Buddy path. Gotta stay hydrated, absolutely. Save spot, and what's this? Bidding time? What's the bidding time? Or, oh, biting time, I'm dumb. <laughs> Postcard from Eric. My darling, soon we shall wa walk together once more, hand in hand through this stout of all forest and fall. I shall be yours again, and you mine. And Cologne shall have both of us as it should be. Hope you are looking forward to it as much as I. I'm counting the days. Sometimes I hear the sound of a tin whistle wafting over from the French trench. Then I think of you, and I know all will soon be well again. Give my mama a kiss for me. Yours, Eric. October 9th, 1917. Going home soon? Good. I'm glad you'll be going home soon. Sleep, get back into your own bed. Keep your head down? Okay, I'll do my best when I'm coming out of the fucking trench. Yikes. Yeah, we found this earlier, I remember. Oh, is it a fuse? Okay. Some wires there, too. He said we blew some wires out. What the fuck? Holy shit. Shit! God damn! All right.
Hello? Oh, did the bird get shot and I fell? Yep. On your feet, soldier! Come on, throw me the fuse! Here you go. Nice fucking grab. Here! Ooh. After it! Get that hellish monstrosity! I'll repair the searchlights! Then we can finish the job! Finish the job! Don't tell me you're getting job. tired now! Go, go, go! Alright, calm your fucking tits, dude. I got a fucking bolt action rifle now. I'm ready to fuck things up. I'm coming for you, you bastard. Seven. Ah. Twenty seven. Everything is twenty seven. There's another one. We we're at twenty out of twenty eight. On the searchlight. Got seats on this thing. Diesel. I have no way to get on top of it. All right, so it's not for me to handle then. One of those might work against the fucking thing, too. The spotlights, man, are... <sighs> really something. This is 27 madness. I haven't got rid of the barbed wire yet. What the fuck? Hey, that's my fucking gun. What a dickhead. I got a good headshot on him now. <laughs> fucking hurt. All right. Uh, now what? Find and activate more searchlights. Makes sense. Mm. Excuse me. Holy shit. What the fuck? I'm getting there, dude. Hold on. Thanks for the fucking pep talk, dude.
Thanks. Where the fuck am I? Oh shit. Watch out for the pigeons, you flash it to scare them away. Okay. Audio got funky there for a minute. Okay. He's all cut up. Stand for our freedom. If only Paul were old enough, he'll make a real soldier. A real soldier. The war began with the mobilization. They let Johannes sign up straight away to head to the Western Front and become a hero, but you had to stay at home. Why didn't you? Alright. Oh shit. Well, he was older. He was able to go. I was a child. We, we good? We get that now? Okay, great. Moving on. Oh, that's the way I came from. I don't think I want to go that way this time. There we go. Now we're going the right way. Uh, excuse me. Okay. Now where am I going? Through some barbed wire, I guess. Here's some pigeons. Okay, I made it across. I have to go this way, I guess. So put the dancing feathers. What the fuck is that all about? Finally, your chance to show everyone what you're made of. You're a lieutenant commanding a company on the Western Front. Thanks for the they boots. At you. What There's some mighty strange happenings going on here.
Okay. Another bird gonna dispatch of. Thank you. I feel like I'm playing that level in max pain that's like a nightmare. Like none of this seems real. The dimensions of this is just really wonky. <laughs> but of course that's the point of the whole story. You understand that. What do we fucking have here? Oh, that's right. I died. And I forgot. The Johannes sobs louder. Nest, was Mother right? Did a cuckoo sneak into your home while you were away? This will come down. Here we are. Oh, this is the thing that moves. Okay, that's right, that's right. Let's uh, just move it out of the way like this. Okay, nope. Or not. There we go. I really heard a dog just flap their ears around. miss a light somewhere? I don't think so. Huh. I can say it's the way I have to go. Slide on down. supposed to okay I didn't even see this fucking thing sitting here that would have made a lot more sense Jug, how's it going starting here if you said anything to me had ads oh rope I'm doing good man just chill playing this game it's been pretty good so far and how are you doing today Guthrie rope whatever that creature in the attic is deserves to suffer, but what if... Soma, what oh. the fuck was that? No. <laughs> and hello, Soma. Welcome in. I would assume I'm their son. Or jugs. Yeah, exactly. Poor me. Ooh, 
important. Not sure I told you, but I completed the nightmares last night. Oh, what did you think? Did you like it? 27. All right, who's doing the walking? Soma. You're so mean to me. You just got here and you're already being a bully. <laughs> Glad to see we're taking this very seriously, Soma. Oh, fuck. did it. Not too bad. It was really good. I need to invest in the second one. Yes, you do. The second one was fucking magical. I scared that bird away before I even realized I did. There we go. Some bad wire. Nice. All right. <laughs> Fucking hell. Soma. Thank you for the biddies. It's like a trap door of some sort. Should you able to go underneath? Yeah. Piece of fucking cake. No more spotlights, so I gotta fucking turn on in this make believe world. Oh, it's a wheelchair on top of the light. I'm like, what the fuck am I looking at? Oh no! Oh, fuck that. Oops, my bad. A little too close to the barbed wire. What have they done to you? Anyways, just wanted to see what was up. I'm going to head out. Have a good stream. Thanks, Rope. Have a good night, dude. And uh, hopefully you get a, a hold of um, Little Nightmares too soon. Game is outrageous. The cuckoo. No, it can't be him. You left him behind. That can't be. What if it is him? All right, moving on forward again.
Okay. Fuck. I'm releasing this thing. Oh, because it's the light. Oh, no. My son is dead. He's dead. Why didn't you listen to him? Brother, he was as good as dead. You took one look at him among all that wire and ran. He can't have come back, can he? So this is the dummy. The shining light all six searchlights. I didn't even fucking hear it. This way, maybe? Okay, well, flying pigeons can push you over the edge. Maybe you can find something to interrupt their flight path. We go down at all? Just consistently flying into barbed wire and shredded into fucking cheese. My children. <sighs> My sons. Forgiveness will be yours if you grant him his freedom. If I grant him his freedom. Who do I have in custody? <laughs> That's bizarre. I don't think I want to take that way yet either. I think there was another way to go up here. Okay. 
say anything about that. Maybe I do have to jump down here after all. I guess so. Go ahead. Pain. Born of darkness and night. Made flesh. Desecrated. Defeated. Undying. We live on in eternal plight. Damn, bro. Waiting orders, answer the field telephone six times. Huh. Grab the abomination and wring its neck. Wring its neck. Not a moment to lose. For the fatherland, soldier. Real quick, how many achievements are we at this point? 14 of 29? There's only three that aren't, there's 12 hidden achievements. There's read all letters, find all German identification plates, and find all French identification bracelets. What's this? Birds love to be free. Yes, they do. What's up, Disconnected? Thanks for the bits, dude. How you doing? We're about to fight a giant bird person. Tired? Maybe. Herb. This area your actions will have consequences.
<laughs> Birdman, Tony Hawk. A small bird cage. Who gives a fuck? Oh shit! All right. Well, I just learned my fucking lesson. Can we leave? Now? Oh god. It's alive. Fuck you. Oh fuck. What am I doing? Just lowering all these? Fuck you! I don't even know what the hell this is doing. Start the abomination or help it help it free itself? Wait, what am I doing? What am I meant to do here? We're all four posts, like, just chilling. I guess I pushed them all up then? I don't know. his mouth come on dude what are you doing god that was annoying What am I supposed to be doing? <laughs> what you need to figure what you need to do is figure out what you need to do. Thanks, John Madden. Uh I 
don't know why that hurts. I'm dodging them. How do I trap it in the cage? me fuck I'm stuck Yeah, I, I, I don't really know what to do here. Hey, Miss Mad Duck, what's up? How am I supposed to trap it? I tried to right there. Can't do that. Yo, Jeff, what's up? How's it going, man? I know what the hell I'm doing. Force myself to go to bed after a long day of Dragon Quest Builders 2. Well, hope you get some good rest, Miss Mad Duck. Thank you for dropping in and saying hey, anyways. All right, how's the game? Uh, good, up until this boss fight. I'm very confused. So it says... Objectives is to hurt the abomination or help it free itself. I don't know how to hurt it. Like, I know that light's supposed to hurt it. I think I just put these things up, but I don't really know. Still gonna lurk? Oh, well, thank you. I appreciate that. We're standing on top of this barbed wire. So it's always in the light. Is that correct? Yep. Oh, I see. Oh, shit.
Oh, fuck. I'm making you dizzy? I'm sorry. So, I think I just have to time it right. That didn't work. Fuck. Jesus. That work? What the fuck? What the hell happened here? tricked me. Yeah, I don't I don't know what to do here. I really don't. Why did that go down? Hello? Thanks, Anonymous Door Slam. So, it circles around. Fuck, it, just it still doesn't, like, fly into it, though. I'm very confused. dead. Oh. Yeah, I don't know what to do here. I'm just gonna take the L and I'm gonna go look it up. I just don't understand. Thank you again for another anonymous door slam. Oh, what's up, Meg? How's it going? Yeah, I'm toast. Oh, boy. I'm dead.
<laughs> like, I don't know what just happened. All right, so while that's loading, I'm going to go figure out what the fuck I'm supposed to do with this boss fight. Okay, I think I found a guide. Maybe. Just reading up on so it says use lever to raise all the pillars. Of the pillars for after the third time, pain will grab oh, in front of the pillars. Oh, I was hiding behind it. Maybe that's why. it fuck Come on. Ah. Apparently there's three different endings for this game too. Oh, God. Oh, so, no. I don't want to. I guess I have to. There's no other button. Wait. I didn't press it. Still pain. I didn't, even pre I didn't press the, the button to hit him. I wonder. Chapter 4. Look at the reflections. The greedy eye of the old enemy. Okay.
the fuck? Your fault. Pain, born of darkness and night. Made flesh, desecrated, defeated. Well, what the hell? Undying, we live on in eternal plight. Pervert, by killing him, you have eliminated pain. A oh, man's missing a fucking arm. Just go back now, I guess. Okay, bye. Which door do I go to? Fatherland is your duty. How could I be so blind, so cowardly? Paul, you are alive, and your brother, too. Forgive me, please. I haven't been a good father to you, nor a good husband to Madeleine. How can we go on from here, my son? His dad wanted to make things better. You remember at first he didn't believe it was really you, then he recognized you. Shit, did I come home all fucked up? I'm guessing that's what happened. Now I'll go to the far door. now this one yeah we killed this thing too no shadow of death fear evil despair like the night you return again A mad woman. By killing you, you have brought an end to despair. What am I doing now? Look the truth in the face. Alright, so what am I missing? Because I'm pretty sure I went through all these doors, unless- Oh, this is a different door now. This is a mirror! <gasps> Fuck! <laughs> you still don't understand, do you? There's no such thing as a hard victory. Not for us. What the fuck?
What the fuck? And soldier. May go to war once again with in full of pride to read the agreement in your dog tag. Paul von Schmidt, Berlin. Wait. I'm in the asylum? This whole time I've just been fucking crazy? Eating some schlop? Now what do I fucking do? Face brother, I would love to look the truth in the face, but ain't no one here for me. Nothing else for me to open up here, I don't think. What am I fucking doing here? Visiting time. Oh. Hello? Oh, fuck. They're in here with me. Yikes. So I guess you're not supposed to kill them. If you want the good ending, I guess. I'm just... Use the whole story. Human dignity is invi invi inviolable. 20 million people lost their lives during the First World War. Never ending suffering traumatized entire nations, destroyed families, and left people with physical and psychological scars they carried for the rest of their lives. Well, shit. Got it beat. Um. I liked it, I'm just... I'm trying to determine exactly what happened. So I, I get it, my, my character is in an asylum. He went bonkers from the battlefield. But me killing these things in my head released them into the real world I I could just be I guess he was seeing things but <laughs> I feel like there's a deeper meaning here and I'm just missing some of the pieces to set the table so to speak but not too bad I was hoping his his voice is gonna go <laughs> We'll just skip the credits, that's fine. All right, well, that's Ad Infinitum. Dunzo. See you later. Um, good game, though. I'm glad I played it. Um, and big shout out to Dolly, by the way. Uh, Dolly actually got um, a bunch of keys for the Channel 13 folks to play this game. So I was, uh, I was lucky enough to be able to play this game without paying anything. Um, I couldn't even tell you how much this game is on Steam to begin with, but I'm going to tell you in a moment. Uh. Why can I not find it? Well, I just go through here, here, store page. So this game is going for $35, $34.99 USD. 
Um, so yeah, I'm glad I got it for the, the free 99 cover, that's for sure. But uh, overall, pretty decent game. I was enjoying it. Um, the puzzles were fun too. They weren't super difficult or anything like that. So yeah, I'm, I, ain't that, I ain't that mad with the ending. I'm cool with leaving with the worst ending imaginable. Um, so there's the worst ending is kill all bosses. The bad ending... Um, I guess you have to kill one of them and save the other two, and then the good ending is you save all of them. Hmm. Well, okay. Anywho. So, we actually finished a little bit earlier than I, I didn't know if we were going to finish it tonight, but we did. So that's cool. Um, hmm. What to play? Mm -hmm -hmm. Oh, you know what we really should do? Is uh, probably Pinewood. I am part of the... Uh, I am part of the group after all here. Okay, let me, I think what I have now is the old alpha. Oh, there's an update. It still calls it the prologue though, which is interesting. Yeah, all right, I guess we'll, uh, let's see if I can get it to load and it's actually the new beta. Oh, it does pop up as beta. It's the desktop icon was wonky. Uh, but this one of those games I have to stay clicked in for it to open up. All I have is a black screen on my side, so you guys aren't missing anything. Oh, it's just popping up now, actually. Subtitles on. Just getting all the settings set up for now, so we're good to go. Controls. Oh, that's controller type. Okay, you know what? Let me unplug the foot pedals just in case. Yeah, key bindings, primary, secondary, aim weapon, next weapon, previous reload, space, jump, crouch, shift, okay. Push to talk.
I'll leave everything at epic, I guess. Um, oh, motion blur is already disabled. That's nice. Love to see it. All right, I guess everything else looks good here. Okay, let's see. So that's going good now. Um, just the audio is not being captured yet. I can fix that. One of these. Okay, this is uh, the Pinewood Valley. Uh, prologue. They released the prologue yesterday. Um, I wanted to play it yesterday, but I mean, I was so enthralled with the telephone that it just wasn't going to happen. Um, yeah, let's check out this game together, huh? Okay. <clears throat> Welcome to Camp Sump. Summers Hill. The campers have went home, so Eli and his four friends are spending their last night as counselors in Camp Summers Hill. The best experience we recommend exploring when you can. Safety first. Walk, do not run. So I heard there was some uh, FPS issues with this game to start off, so we'll see what happens. Um, it still hasn't fully loaded for me yet. <laughs> What the fuck was that? Yeah, it's it's pretty choppy. Jesus, this music is loud. Nineteen eighty six. Okay. That's enough of that. I can't hear myself think. Oh man, oh my I was God. listening this to that. This is not too performing bad. well. Okay. What do you guys want to do tonight? Oh God, can I please fix this? Why my music was playing in the background? That was funny. Um, holy shit. Yeah, we need to fucking turn this down, boy. Put it down to medium and see what that does. Yeah, everything feels like it's super slow. It's our last night in this dump, and we finally don't have any kids to watch. Tell some stories like last time? <laughs> yeah, that was fun. I say we do that again. You guys want to hear a spooky story? Okay. Sure. Totally. Okay, let's begin then. Have you guys ever heard about the carpet? Definitely outside? rendered. <laughs> it took a while. No. Nope. No. Oh, dude! I actually tried out for uh, is it about the, the voice actors for the three two male characters here. Ding, ding, ding. Apparently, they burned down his cabin with him in it. He survived with parts of his mask burned into his face. Okay. Um. Please stop now. This story is already giving me the creeps. True stories usually do. Okay. You can stop now. Fine, I'll stop. The subtitles are so small, too. I think the nurse left some liquor at her cabin. I'm gonna go check. Kevin, are you coming? After hearing that story? No can do, dude. <laughs> <laughs> ah, fine, I'll go on my own. Chicken. It's your turn to tell a story when I get back. What's taking him so long? <laughs> he should be back by now. It's only a five-minute walk. 
Maybe he decided to drink all the liquor himself. Hell yeah. <laughs> Sounds like him. Okay, I'm gonna go out and look for him. If he has, let's hope he hasn't drank it all yet. <laughs> Watch the caretaker doesn't get to him. <laughs> okay. Oh, the god, the sensitivity. Holy shit. Oh my god, is there no... Okay, Whew. Oh my god, I cut that down. I don't think that did fucking anything. Jesus Christ, sorry, just that's... That's gonna become worrisome very quickly for me. Right, this is doable. Okay. Just let me know if uh if the stream starts acting like really shitty for you guys. At the moment it looks like it's okay. And sprint. Oh shit. I can't get back on the road. <laughs> what? My jump won't work to get me over there. Oh no. <laughs> Did I find a spot where it's small? Oh, there we go. I had to find a better spot. <laughs> Missing cat, black and white and sad, last seen at the park running for his freedom. Got the info, call 303-555-2009. Gibbon. So is there like a, uh, okay. All right, so there's no What was that? Took a fucking sprint. I don't even know where I'm supposed to be going, anyways. Oh, not this way, because that's... What the fuck? Do you all just hear that, too? Like, there's just audio in there? Like, not just the animal, but there's, like, literal spoken words? Random water bottle? Okay. We'll try this way. Yeah, uh, I just, I don't know where this dude went to, and I don't remember. Oh, the nurse's station. Jake? You out there? Jake? Do not enter. Okay. Jake? I was gonna check the outhouse first, but okay, I guess we're going into red. Creepy ass fucking book.
Can't open that door. A highway sign of some sort. What the fuck is going on here? There's something in here I'm supposed to see. Can't do anything with that book. Oh, the rest of the lake just fucking appeared there. Nice lake, though. There's mountains up there. Tons of stars up there in the sky. Not a bad night. I just don't know what my current objective is. Guess I'll just fucking leave then because I can't go anywhere else down here. I had to go back to that sign and take a look to see where, which way the nurse's station is. I'm like. That could be the nurse's station down there, because we were looking for the kid. Go back over here, because this is, tells us where to go. Okay, campfire, meeting house, lake, lodging, nurse. This way. Alright, so this is where I came out. The front door. That's why I initially was heading the right direction. I think I just saw this shit over here that I was like, well, alright, fuck all that. We'll find the nurse's station. Jake! You out there? Venture awaits. I don't think that's where I want to go. The nurse's station is down here. Venture forest? What the fuck? Is this it? Right, there's a wheelchair out front. A miracle happened here today. <laughs> Jake? Hello? me. Ah, yes, the periodic table of elements. And multiplying. It's the two things I love to do when I have a headache and want to go lay down. <laughs> well, there's the bottle of liquor, so we didn't even go get it. I better go back and tell the others. Or maybe he's already back. Take the fucking bottle with you, dumbass. Okay. Fucking not. <laughs> I mean, that's what I would have done. Alright. We'll just, uh, head back then. I wasted all that time running around the fucking property. <laughs> Son of a bitch. So wish I could sprint. That'd be great. Need to. Hmm. 
Doors up around the corner here that can actually open. Doors already opened. Hello. It said to go back to hang out with everybody. The fuck. Where am I supposed to go? Oh, maybe it's where the campfire is because they wanted to get booze. Enough of that. I don't want to listen to the random person talking in the woods either. Campfire. This way. I would really love for this sprint button to work now. What does this say here? Campfire to... Right, okay. Oh, I can see it from here. Me, bitch. What was there? Excuse me. Formicophilia, a form of zoophilia, is the sexual oh, interest no. in being crawled upon or nibbled by insects, such no. as ants, or other small creatures. This paraphilia often involves the application of insects to the genitals, but other areas of the body may also be the focus. The desired effect may be a tickling, stinging, or in the case of slugs, slimy sensation, or the infliction of psychological distress on another person. The more you know, Rainbow. The more you know, Rainbow. Well, thanks for that information. Now, where the hell is everybody? I was assuming we we're gonna come here. But I guess that's not the fucking case. So, now where do I go? This is the nurse's station. Let's see if I can go into this adventure forest. Adventure forest is strictly forbidden without a counselor. Well, I'm a counselor, so let me in. So this is confusing now. Where are these guys supposed to be? adventure awaits up here. <laughs> Fuck you, bro. Lemonade stand, too. Welcome back, campers. Uh, yeah, so, so far I can't go into any of these little cabins. I guess isn't that super surprising.
Okay, well... I did another big circle. I... Uh... Lodging, nurse, the meeting house, campfire, we've been to the lake, I've been everywhere. back down towards the lake before I go down that road just in case they didn't end up coming down here after the fact I'm pretty sure they didn't but See shit. Oh, excuse oops, excuse me. <clears throat> so I'll head over to the right after this. Like a hard right. If there's anything further down, because I think everything else I've covered. I don't really know what else I'm supposed to be doing. Do I have an inventory? Yeah, apparently nothing. It's just the it's just the Discord server. I have no documents. Nothing else crazy. Alright. It's the meeting house right in front of us. Stay on this road. This just brings us to the path back. I have no idea. What am I supposed to be doing here? Like, there's, there's seriously no... I'm not too sure what I'm supposed to be doing. I, I, well, I, I know I'm supposed to, like, meet back up with them again. Who's out there? Oh. Went this way before, and it didn't do anything like that. You go around back? They didn't go around back here. Okay. Visible wall that way. I'm mightily confused here, everybody. I apologize.
Nothing selectable there. Can't even pick up the booze. Coffee tables upside down. What the fuck? Yeah, like nothing is selectable in this game. I'm having a hard time determining like what is it that I'm supposed to be doing? Am I am I gonna eventually trigger something? Like I triggered that audio from that dirt path. They must, they must be inside this fucking building, and I'm just unsure how to open a fucking door. I need to refamiliarize myself here. Yeah, sprint. That's funny. Pause documents inventory. That's it. There's no button to open a door. If the door ain't open, the door ain't open. I mean, I guess that's fine. Oh. Okay. Just approaching the door and it, it worked. Got it. Hello? Hello, oh, my friends. Well, that's not good. Oh, my God. We fuck. Gotta get out of here. What the fuck is going on? What happened to Kevin? No Kevin was too me. high. <laughs> follow me. Okay. After you. Yeah, no shit, huh? Being real quiet, I see. At least the power's still on. I can't control any of this, by the way. Oh, God! Shit! Get away from him! <clears throat> Damn. Well, shit. Kevin injected one marijuana. <laughs> Riz, what's up? I need to get help. God, Kevin got fucked up. Um, how do I get out of this? There we go. This motherfucker was hiding this. He was hiding in the laundry room.
Shit. Ashley's in trouble. Yo, Ash is gonna have to fucking wait. Sounded like it came from the lake. Thank you. Now I know where to go. Hey, you guys up there? Camp rules. Nobody's allowed in the woods without a counselor. Respect nature, respect facilities, respect counselors and other campers. If you go anywhere alone, do camping chores, keep clean. As your campers, curfew begins 10 p.m. Anyone caught past curfew will face consequence. Gotcha. All right, well, I'm not going upstairs. Instead, let's go to the lake. Hello? All right. Uh, big chillin? I kind of am too, although. <laughs> oh. This beta is, um, kind of giving me some attitude at the moment. Oh, can't go upstairs. I very much just want to go to the lake to help my friend out. But I can't find a door that'll let me in or out rather. This one should work. What? That didn't work either? How the fuck do I get out of here? Because the front door won't let me out either. <clears throat> I can't go upstairs. Wow, like every step in this game so far has been not very intuitive. Yeah, I don't. <sighs> Fucking ridiculous. Something over here that I needed to pick up. See, no. I got booted over here first. Uh, fashion. Press any key to continue. Well, it ain't working.
Sorry, I know this is not like the greatest content. I'm uh, there's there's nothing that could help explain what I'm supposed to be doing to get out of this fucking building. Is I, I guess the door I came in through. Excuse me. Suddenly locked, or I can't do anything with it. Um... Yeah, this is pretty unbearable. I think, to be honest, there's there's no like audio outside of my footsteps. There's no like background music. There's no ambience at all. Um, I don't know how much more time I'm going to try to spend on this. Are you f Hello, Pinewood Valley Sheriff's Office. Oh, thank God. We, we need help. There's, there's a guy, he, he killed my friend and I don't know where my other friends are. He, he might have got them too. Okay, calm down. Where are you? We're up at Camp Summers Hill. Please hurry. I'll be there in ten minutes. Get somewhere safe and I'll find you. I can't. I have to see if my friends are okay. Wait! Don't do that! But wait! Okay, so I had to find the tele- Now I need to go to the lake. No stairs in the front, only the sides. All right, we've made progress again. At least out here there's some ambience with like the fucking like animal like what they animal is keeper frogs or whatever. I should find a weapon. It might still be around. Shovel, there we go. Not controlling any of this, by the way. <coughs> hey, Ashley! Oh no! Fuck. You killed my friends! I'm gonna kill you, you sick fuck! Stay back, kid! That man got shot in a bad spot. He is screaming. And all that happened so long ago, but I still have nightmares, and there's not a day goes by that I don't think about it. That's not uncommon. That all must have been very traumatic. What about the man who did those awful things? He died that night? 
No, um, he survived and is rotting in that asylum that's just outside of Pinewood Valley. What about the camp owners? Where were they? They were gone for the night. They left us there alone and... It's only been 20 years since that shit happened to us. And they have all already forgotten. I need to go back to that town and try to convince them to not reopen the camp. Nice. Well, I could see this sign from Whip. Okay, that's it. <laughs> so that's pretty good. Pretty good prologue. Um, in terms of, like the story and starting to build out some of the concepts. Um. But it, it, it definitely didn't have that much in there. Uh, like, I never got to use the inventory system. Um, the, there's, like, there's no objective system. I mean, there is, but it wasn't, like... They didn't make it clear that I had to... Like, they said I should call for help, but it also said, oh, that came from the lake. I was trying to go to the lake the whole time. <sighs> yeah. Excuse me, so there's, like, an objective list. I was like, oh... Call for help first, then go to the lake or something like that. It'd be better, but small things. Um, but yeah, I'm looking forward to see how this game progresses and they eventually release it in full. Um, we've now played the alpha demo, which takes place in the regular like time frame um, or timeline. And it's like the town's going to shit. And this is a beta, and it's the prologue um, of the game. So, yeah, not bad. Um, I will say, though, um, I think this is going to be where I'm going to wrap it 25 minutes early. So I apologize, but um, I was also late by about 20 minutes. So, you guys aren't getting the full four hours out of me today, and I apologize. Um, even if we had the nine hours yesterday, uh, today was a scheduled day. I want to make sure I had it right. But um, yeah, add infinitum is finito. It's done. And uh, <clears throat> excuse me. And uh, we just finished the uh, the Pinewood Valley beta prologue. So. Good. Making good progress. Um, I'm assuming that I'll be picking something else for Monday. I do have some uh, like key mailer games when I get to as well. And we still have more Return of the Oberdin to play as well. Uh, which we've got, looks like we kind of like marked out a bunch of stuff. We found all the bodies and everything. It's just a matter of putting all the, um, all the clues together. So that is that. Um, let me go ahead and find someone we can raid. Uh, let's see. Knox is doing dark and darker. Dan is playing Call of Duty. Korean's playing uh, Rainbow Six Siege. Endeavor Endeavor's playing Phasmo. Hamster's playing Boo Men. Creepy's playing Irisu Syndrome. Actually, we haven't uh we haven't raided Creepy in a while, and I do enjoy the raid music over in Creepy's stream. Let's see. Okay, that's good to go. So, um, Really quick, just for everybody, if you don't mind, that uh, are coming over on the raid, um, you'll see on the chat, there is the two different messages we could send. The top one, which I'm punching in again, uh, that one is for subscribers. Everyone else can use the one that says raid with the red pickaxe or some other uh, emote that you have possession of. If uh, you're looking to follow me on some other platforms, you find me on YouTube, uh, we post up the VODs and YouTube shorts there. 
And uh, if you prefer your YouTube shorts to be TikToks, I'm also on TikTok. Uh, Twitter, I am also on where, or X, I gotta fucking change that, I guess. Um, I'm there making announcements, sharing some things. Um, but it's a, it's a good place to, to be if you need to stay on top of what's coming up and when I go live and so on and so forth. And then Discord is going to be the number one place to get the uh, announcements earlier. And um, I mean, that and everything else that comes with Discord servers. So if you have room for another Discord server, come join the Jug Mob and I over at the Discord and our home away from home. Good night to you too, Riz. Always a pleasure seeing you. Um, so yeah, let's... Uh, Let's get rolling. Let's let's get this raid over to Creepy Pastero. Uh, she's a dear friend of mine, part of the CEOs of Screams. Is my stream deck gonna be broken now all of a sudden? No, okay, it works, it's working now. Okay, cool, cool, cool. Alrighty, uh, let's kick this raid off. Again, thank you all so much. It's been a really great week. Um, I'll be back next week, usual schedule. I, I'm pretty certain, I'd have to double check, but... Um, You'll be getting the up-to-date schedule for next week, uh, either tomorrow, late tomorrow, or early Monday. Um, but yeah, that's going to do it for tonight. Thank you all once again. Please go hang out with Creepy, and if uh, you dig her content, consider dropping that follow. I would super appreciate it. I know she would too. So uh, yeah, until Monday, uh, be good. And um, enjoy the spoopy season. We're uh, we're getting real close to Halloween, and uh, and I'll be sure to update the totals with uh, Jugtober as well. Alrighty, I'm out. Bye.